video, I'm going to be revealing to you the tips to writing effective subject lines. The tips to writing effective subject lines. You see, email marketing is one of the most powerful methods of making money online. But no matter how great your email campaign is, if your prospects and subscribers do not open your emails, your campaign is as good as dead. What is the advantage of sending an email to thousands and thousands of people even when they are not going to read it? Okay? It's a waste of time. So you have to find a way to make sure that your prospect, your subscribers are opening the emails you send to them. Okay? So in order to get your emails opened, there are some tips that I suggest you follow. Let's take a look at them. The first thing is to write like you're writing to your friend. Write your subject line like you're writing to a personal friend. When you go into your inbox online, you notice that emails from friends with informal subject lines receive your attention first. For instance, when you open your email box and you see subject lines like Dear Bob, if your name is Bob, for instance, it says, Bob, where did you keep the key yesterday? And an email that says, Bob, you have been chosen to make $1 million online. You naturally attend to the ones that give you a personal, a personal touch. Where did you keep the keys yesterday? It's like a personal friend. That must be an email from a personal friend. Okay? Attract this kind of attention by writing simple official sentences at your subject lines. Write lines like, I hope this will, this will be of help to you. The day I met you in child, I must be mad to give you this. Be imaginative and you'll come up with a few related sentences that are related to your message. Okay? The next thing you can do is to ask a question. Ask a question. Asking a question in your subject line creates curiosity and makes your subscribers open your emails. Just ask a question related to your message and you're done. For example, if you're giving us a special offer, you can ask a question like this. Will you take this up? Or what if I give you all this? Because naturally, questions demand answers. So people will want to know more so that they will be able to answer your question. They will be able to tell, do what they ask them to do. So questions always work. Another thing you should do, or this time never do, is that don't hype. Never hype. A lot of marketers are often tempted to convey a marketing message in their subject lines which usually results in hyped up subject lines. If you're lucky enough to get past spam filters, spam filters, your subscribers will still not be happy with you. Remember, no one likes being sold to. Personally, I usually delete messages like make millions or subject lines with too many capitals as well as fancy gimmicks like a row of asterisks. Another thing you can do is to always personalize. Always remember to include the first name of your subscribers in your subject line. Not every time, but do it lots of times. This is a very important technique. People tend to take a close look at subject lines that have their first name in it. You can easily do this using your autoresponder service. Another thing you can do is to use regular sentences. If you have a regular schedule of, schedule of sending out email campaigns, try giving your campaign a regular name.
For instance, if you send up your newsletter at the beginning of every month, you can always use the line, your newsletter is ready. Sentences they are used to. Also, if you send out special offers for your subscribers and they love you for it, you can keep using the same line like my gift to you this month over and over again. You see, using these tips I've just shared with you here hmm, will help you write more effective subject lines which will improve the rate at which your subscribers open your emails, which means they will naturally buy, naturally buy more from you. That, I'm sure, will make you happy. Thank you very much for your time.